Welcome back, everyone, to another exciting episode of Lisa the Joyful. I'm your host, Mr. Gazillion, and in the last episode, we finished off this giant list of names that held the leaders of Olaf, and our goal was to become the leader of Olaf and kill all of them. There was no mercy to be had. In fact, I think Mr. Beautiful was actually a pacifist, so yeah, we're monsters. And now there's blood everywhere. The joy, don't run. So basically, we finished the game. You'll need it. So we finished the game, but maybe not. There seems to be a lot of stuff around here. Um, how's our health? Our health is high enough. I am poisoned, though. And uh, that's Brad right here. You're almost free. No, that was already where we had been. So I don't think there's anything on this side. I actually think we have to go back the other way. I'm not too sure what we'll find. But there are messages that seem to say that we'll need joy and all this stuff. So I'm thinking we're not going to use the joy. Or at least I'm hoping not. And oh my god, there is a lot more stuff than there used to be. Does this guy still look happy? Doesn't look anything. They're all dead. Oh, good. That's good. Um, do I have soup? A bottle of soup. Yes, we're gonna use it. Just to get, bring us a little bit over the top. Oh no, it's this guy. Oh, and that's actually him playing the trumpet. You haven't turned? <laughs> that's okay. You did well. Very well. Hmm. Make me proud, baby. <laughs> Who is that guy? I wonder if he's one of the mysterious figures from the beginning. Ooh, this thing's scary. All right, that thing has actually been saving us all game, so it's kind of unfortunate that we have to be killing him right now. So um, while that we're full health, let's actually apply Leech Bomb on him because it seems to be very good for us. And it failed. Of course it did. 700. We can try one of these one more time. Yes! Screamed and it failed, but 9,000 damage, so let's mend. I don't know if it has a super move that can do a, a thousand damage. That's good for me. We'll do a strike to try and make it bleed at the same time. Ooh, yeah! Ooh, that's what I was afraid of, and 10,000 damage now. We're doing really well. Uh, let's apply... Maybe we can try and flash it. At least once, and... Ooh, ooh, now we have bleed. Oh, God. Um, yeah, we're gonna mend big time now. We're gonna mend, I think, until we don't have any poison left. We're weirded out. Another one. So, thankfully, we weren't too reckless when we were applying some of this stuff here. I had enough health to take that big stab. So, let's do a decisive strike again. Ooh, I missed it. Dang it. Our bleed's gone, so that's good. Ours, not theirs. Alright, another bleed. And that, that does a lot of damage. Poison is gone, so we're going to mend once until it tries to make us weird again. Stand back! Oh. The joy. Yado has a vaccine. It will stop you from mut mutating. What? We don't have time to talk. Go get him, but... Oh. Go get who? Um, I want to use some horse jerky. Yeah, it's kind of useless right now because it's crappy jerky. What the heck is this? What? How? You're not that strong. Who are you? No, you aren't. You aren't supposed to be here. Who are you? Why are all the? Why are the beasts obeying you? Leave, or I'll. I'll kill you. Huh. How's that? I'll... Out of all the men I've seen, you're the most pathetic one. You can't even look at me in the eyes when you threaten me. Now tell me what's going on. Uh, you don't understand. Fine, then. I don't care who you are. I want that throne. Oh, God. And now we have nothing? Are you freaking kidding me? Uh, I could try and use a ration that gives me some TP, but these are SP, so I don't actually have one. Well, you know what? Why don't we just try and apply some fire, some burning on him? Boom! No, that failed. 
So that was the last one. So we'll just stab to get some TP. Because I need eight for poison. <clears throat> Excuse me. And I need seven for men. So let's try and get a poison in. Come on, yes. Yado's just staring at us blindly, blankly. Hmm, that's not what I wanted. Is he gonna start attacking soon? Um, so poison's not so super good on this guy. Wait, is there another target? There isn't. Okay, that's good to know. Let's try and make him bleed. Something tells me that this thing can bleed pretty good. It's all like tumory and stuff. He's staring blankly. Oh, come on, decisive strike. Work. Yes, bleed. Oh, buddy's head starts to hurt. Why? Ooh, I really don't care about much for that. Is he still poisoned though? Oh no, he's not. All right, let's try and add a poison because our health's still high enough. And there you go. So he's empowered though. Ooh, that's not good. Um, I can't mend. I could try and put him to sleep, but I'd rather accumulate more TP right now. So we evaded that one. Okay, so let's mend because I have no idea with him on Joy how much damage that can cause. So we're full health. He's just glaring at us and we feel weird. And he's no longer empowered. Okay. That's all good. Good and dandy, but there you go. Four. Oh, okay. But he can't control it. Is that Rando? I don't really understand what's going on right now, but I don't think he has poison anymore. Does he? Nope. Oh, it's Rando now. Leech. Po yeah, let's do it. Poison. There you go. Our 50 50 has been pretty good lately. I don't want to jinx it, but yeah, we've been doing okay. And Rando's crying, and I'm super unfortunate that we're killing Rando, but we don't care about anyone here. And Rando's crying some more. Um, I'm gonna mend once because he has all the status on him. Get us to full health. Rando's crying. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I get it, Rando. I should probably not kill you. He's holding that flower, which is a memento. Stop bleeding. Well, I don't have enough TP to kill him. There you go. G good luck, sis. So that's the transform. Buddy is losing control. So everyone's transforming? What's going on? That was nothing. Who are we fighting now? Hey, wake up! Today's the big day. You get to go outside today. I know a perfect little spot. You're going to love it. Don't tell me this is all a dream. What's going on? I can't run here. And I can't go that way. Always forward, I guess. What is going on? I'm so confused right now. I mean, this is obviously in your head, or at least I think so anyway. Okay, it's gonna make us walk a while and I can't run, so... Rad. Oh, so it looks like we're fighting Brad, eh? Leech bomb. Please poison him. Fail, that's what I was worried. Well, we still have another one, so... Leech bomb. There you go. Brad doesn't want to do this. Well, Brad, you don't really have much of a choice. You started all this. I wonder if I could just guard this in these fights. There might be multiple endings. Oh, man. I wouldn't put it past Dingling to make a game where in the first one you have to kill everything and in the second one you have to spare people. Maybe I had to take some freaking joy uh, in this playthrough. Bleed's gone. We'll put it back on. Still has his poison, so... Ooh! Buddy. Yep, buddy. That was the best I could have come up with. Well, it's simple. You're my little buddy. I always called you that when you were a baby. I guess it just stuck. Brad and buddy. It sounds good to me. Brad misses you. Aw, that's actually really freaking sad. <laughs> he knew he screwed up. 
And now he's taking joy, so he's gonna transform him to a big monster, isn't he? Leech Bomb! Oh, I was afraid of that. Can you not? Brad has given up. Ooh, that's not good. That means he's gonna transform. Yes! He misses us! As he just fills up on frickin' poison. And by poison, I do mean the joy, though he is poisoned now. Brad is lost. Can we save him? I'm not gonna flash him, because that would be horribly inappropriate. Can I just guard? No, I don't think so. I really don't know what I'm doing here, though. Am I supposed to kill him? He's bleeding out. I don't have much to offer in terms of other abilities, but we'll just keep stabbing at him, I guess. He's lost. That's sad. I'm sorry, dude. But that's just what fate's got in store for you. And I don't trust anyone after playing the last one. Stop! Don't call me that! I don't like it! My name is Brad, okay? Call me Brad! What was I calling you before? Dad? Ooh, okay. He doesn't like being called Dad, and he tries to hug us. Well, sorry. Sorry, Brad. <laughs> you're not... You're not gonna... F what is he doing? Oh, he's healing us now? Okay, we're really doing the wrong thing, aren't we? Come on, he tries to hug us, but he's hugging us too hard. I'm actually gonna just bring up my TP for now. What? A boy named Dusty? Who told you that? What did I tell you about asking questions, you idiot? Don't you dare go near your uncles again, you hear me? What? I have no son. Never did. Oh, that's actually super sad, too. Alright, let's poison this guy again. Good. The nobody is a failure. Where- why does he have arms? I'm pretty sure we cut those off, so... Yes, bleed! Now he's hitting himself and he has depression. Oh man, we're really not helping this guy, are we? Nobody wails and he misses on us. He misses- because that's because he misses us. Get it? Get it? He stopped bleeding. We'll apply another one. Oh, come on, really? How am I missing that? And now he's dead. You have to know this, buddy. I was completely lost before I found you. You made me feel something again. Things no one has ever made me feel. You showed me what love really is. And that's why when I look into your eyes, it's the scariest feeling in the world. It's why I bury buried myself so deep into the darkness. But I promise you, I tried so hard to fight it. I tried. And no matter what, I really did love you with all my heart. I'm so sorry I failed you, buddy. I miss you so much. Well, that's not depressing at all. Goodbye. And he's gone. And we're back here. What the? No. My children. No. You got the vaccine. Can we give the vaccine to anyone? Nope, can't give it to him. Can I use it on myself? Well, I never used... Oh, what's this? He's actually sad that he failed Rando. That's also sad. Come back here, whatever your name is. End of the line, coward. It's time you start answering my questions. Ugh. You don't have a choice. No. Start talking or you're dead. Who are you? Get out of here. Answer me. I really don't know what voice I keep giving. You want to test me? You really want to know? I am Yado. I am a man of science. A man of higher power. And this is my world. You are just a pawn. An insect engineered by me. I birthed you. I'm your father. And you must obey me. Oh! Guess uh, Buzzo didn't want us to find the truth. Oh no. Looks like you made it. It's you again. 
Yeah, it's me. I didn't need your help. I know. I just don't want you listening to that man. You should know something. Rad was a good person. What's happened to you wasn't his fault. It's hers. She twisted me up so much inside. I loved her. When she died, I had to blame anyone but myself. Rad never deserved the pain I caused him. Neither did you. Yeah, he's the one who cut her nipple off. That man. He said he was my father. Is it true? Is he my real dad? Ugh. Don't lie to me. No. I worked with him. He's just a crazy old man. I followed Brad his whole life. You're the only one that gave him purpose. Not even Dusty could do that. Brad is your father. He loved you so much. The joy. Me. I drove Brad insane. It was my fault, not his. Why are you telling me this? I guess... You just remind me of her. Huh. I was supposed to be her light. Instead, I let her pull me into the darkness. It's funny. That poor girl. She would have absolutely loved it here. I don't get it. What you did to Brad. To me. Why tell me all of this? Ugh. The vaccine. You get it? I did. Use it. Save yourself. I... Ugh. I'm... Lise... Ugh. I did it. <laughs> I'm a good boy. I swear. I'm good. good. Please. What's going on? Oh, God. He's transforming. Could we use a vaccine on him? We never, we never used Joy. Where is it? Ah, oh, damn it. We don't have it. That's not good. And now we're tired, too. Oh, man. That's not good at all. Hopefully, we can apply a leech bomb on this guy. Damn it. He twists your limbs. 700. Okay, we can try one more leech bomb. Come on. Yes. He doesn't want to do this. Yeah, I kind of got that same feeling. So who's Lisa to him? Is that his daughter? What caused all of this? Yes, we got some bleed in there. He coughed up some blood. Let's mend because I don't trust... Anything this guy can do. Maybe he can get a critical on us and kill us. 800, eh? That's not bad. Wait, first he still has poison everything? Okay, we'll mend. Back to full health. And he's coughing out some more blood. He's still bleeding. Oh, no, he lost the bleed. Oh, I missed it. 800. Lisa, I love you. I love you. I love you. Lisa, help me. Ah, oh, man. Again with this. Alright, let's try one leech bomb. Good, 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 good. And he costs up blood. That's it. I'm free. Oh, wow. One poison did the trick? Really? And we killed him. I was kind of hoping to give him the vaccine, but it wasn't in my inventory. And we got a ton of joy. What are we going to do with it? And now we're all bloodied. Look at that. Huh. I did it. It's okay. I'm okay. Hey. Huh? Who's that? Lisa? Will it be Lisa? You forget about me? I'm assuming it's Lisa. Oh no, it's Rando. Dustin? Huh. It's you. Hmm. What bu what Buzzo told me. What you said. 
Nothing makes sense. I thought I got rid of you. I was free. It was all mine. What? No, I can't. Buddy, listen. We're sorry. We were wrong. You didn't need us. We only held you back. You did it all by yourself. You're strong. You're smart. And you're, you're free. You are a queen. A god. We worship you. We love you. We need you, buddy. You, you can't leave us. Please. We need you. S stay with us. P please. Take the vaccine or join them. We've been on our own this whole time. I think we should actually leave them. Man, I kind of want to know what both endings do here. Let's leave them. What happens when we take the vaccine? They did say that they were good people after all. That's it? A game by Dingling. Huh. Interesting. Written and directed by Austin Jorgens Jorgensen. Well, well, well. This game was so much better than The Painful. Like, The Painful was good, and I think I enjoyed The Joyful as much as I did because of The Painful. It, in The Painful, the game's so difficult, and it's so random, and stuff are completely out of your control. And, uh, that's, I think that's one of the things that bugged me about The Painful. I hate randomness in my RPGs. I like to be in control and learn some of the, uh, battle mechanics and stuff like that. And in that, in that other game, they, they just took things from you. But in this one, we took control back for ourselves. So that's kind of neat. I like that. So what's this? Was the vaccine poison? Is that our grave? Or is that somebody else's grave? Have we been dead the whole time? Were we in purgatory or something? Killed by an abusive father, kind of like Lisa? Now, who is Lisa anyway? Do we have to play the first game to understand this? And was there a point to having a joyless run? Could I have given the vaccine to Brad? Hmm, so many questions. Are we in a real world right now? Like, who are these people? Are we just awakened and free, or...? Man. Huh. What the heck was that? This wasn't the plan. I won't let you do this. You think you have a say in this? She's mine, too. She's, she's meant for this. How can you say that? I... I am the creator. What are you talking about? With her, I will rule this land. What? What about me? You were just a host. I've made her strong, resilient, determined. Huh. And she is to be your queen? Don't be stupid. I created this world and I will rule it. Alone. She'll spark a war. And anyone left alive will be sorted out by my children. Including her. It's perfect. You're disgusting. And you? You're just a used-up bag of flesh. 
You're not needed anymore, darling. So achievement unlock, Yado. Does that mean Yado just died? What's going on? I want to know what that achievement means. What happens if I load this game again and play and just stay with them? <laughs> oh man, I like how this game was set up so far. Is it going to be a sequel to this? I really liked playing as Buddy. Buddy was a really compelling character. I don't know why. It's like... I don't know, revenge fantasy? Like, what is it? Like, like I totally believe in, in justice and, you know, like, I don't really like retribution. Like, I find that it just makes us crazier and it just ends up causing more problems in the long run. You know, like how hate breeds more hate. And so I try to be, you know, having faith in the justice system. And sometimes you'll hear about horrible crimes and you're like, oh, the knee-jerk reaction is, oh, we should hang this guy. You know, he should die or, or, or whatever, pay for his crime. But there's like unforeseen consequences to those kind of rulings, right? Just look what's kind of happening. I don't, I don't want to get super political or anything, but like if you look in what's happening in the Middle East with all the bombings and stuff like that, we're not causing peace we're not doing things that are gonna lead to peace you're just pissing a bunch of people off so i find i mean even just like the whole prison system and stuff like putting someone in jail what good does that do it doesn't do any good to anyone locks them up makes them worse for the most part so so anyway trying to have faith in a system that's better you know I don't, it's kind of like, I don't I don't really know how to formulate what I'm thinking here, but I'm just, to, just to say that Lisa is just gore. It's just, you know, we're taking revenge, we're killing people, we're kicking ass, and we're not taking, we're not even taking names. We're just, we're just going through the list. We're just, no one's getting in our way. And there's something really satisfying about that. It's like cathartic a little bit. It's something that we, you wouldn't really do in the real world. So it's just like a way to just like, release all the rage a little bit but i don't know if that's running against the theme of lisa i mean like who uh, who is buddy and why is she going to be the queen and who's the creator and i guess yato is the one that just got killed by the creator and so what's their plan really i'm guessing there's going to be another game but i don't really know so i might play again and go through the ending scenes and try and see what happens if i stay with them but uh, something tells me that we took the right path. I think we took the, the canon path, you know. And we'll see what happens in the next uh, Lisa game. Assuming there's going to be another one. So as always, I'm your host, Mr. Gazillion. I'd like to thank you for sticking around. Watching the whole series. Uh, and uh, encouraging me to play this game. As I didn't really have plans to play it initially. And had I not been encouraged by you guys, I probably, have, probably wouldn't, have, wouldn't have played it. And uh, that would have been a huge mistake because this game was a ton of fun. So thanks again for the recommendation. And thanks for liking, stopping by, subscribing, and commenting. I enjoy all of your comments. I love discussing games like this one. And I'll see you all in the next series. Bye.